The vastness of our universe and the space surrounding us leaves scientists with countless questions. They are constantly attempting to delve further into the unknown expanse that stretches endless past our atmosphere, and discover what lies beyond the realm of our understanding. Since the Large Hadron Collider first started up on September 10th, 2008, it's been at the centre of many incredible discoveries. As mentioned on CERN's website, it's currently the world's largest and most powerful particle accelerator. The Large Hadron Collider consists of a 27 km ring of superconducting magnets, with a number of accelerating structures to boost the energy of the particles along the way. CERN, the European Physics Research Centre, recently upgraded the Large Hadron Collider. The upgrade comes years after the Collider managed to provide scientists with answers to a riddle when it confirmed the Higgs boson exists. Since being built though, it's been at the centre of a number of theories, with those around the world questioning the true nature of this giant machine. Just yesterday, someone was live-streaming above the Large Hadron Collider when they noticed something strange. They described the object in question as being a set of stationary lines, saying that they didn't move, while hovering above CERN's complex, and that every so often each of the lights would turn on and off, but said that not at any point did they descend in elevation, and described the objects as being in the shape of a triangle or a boomerang. The live stream then started to gain traction as people flooded in to see what this thing was, while at the same time putting forward their own theories in order to explain it. The person who uploaded the live stream was there for over an hour, and they recorded the whole thing. One person said the following, This is a little ominous, isn't it? There's a huge triangular-shaped object hovering above the Large Hadron Collider, while lightning is surrounding it. It's like a scene from a movie. End quote. One of the strangest things about this event was how the objects just stayed in pretty much the same position, and it did this for all of the live stream, with some of the viewers asking how it could have done that. The strange object was made up of four lights that would occasionally turn on and off. At this moment in time, the size of this craft is not known, but some have guessed this anywhere from 40 feet to hundreds of feet in length. Interestingly, this triangle-shaped craft is certainly nothing new, and for years now they've been reported in pretty much every country around the world. What they are, though, is still heavily debated. Some argue that these crafts are part of the latest stealth fleet of either the United States military or UK's military, or some users have questioned how we would have such a thing. Amateur researchers have also noticed how these things are never normally seen during the daytime, Although there have been a few photographs taken during the day, this still hasn't helped us to come to a definitive answer for what these things are, along with how they're able to achieve some of the things they do. There have been around 4,000 reports of the triangle since the 1990 in the UK alone. There have also been waves of triangle sightings in Belgium, France, Holland and Germany. According to databases that keep track of mysterious crafts that have been witnessed, the Black Triangle is one of the most commonly reported by eyewitnesses. Mr. McGrillin, a media journalist, has said that US officials have in their possession a clear photograph of one of these Black Triangles, and said that it shows it rising out of the ocean, saying the insiders are aware of this photograph as they have gone on record as telling others about it, detailing that the craft was captured back in 2019 by a pilot. Mr. McGrillin said the following, it could be a key piece of evidence, demonstrating that we are truly in the presence of some other intelligence. End quote. At the time the pilot was flying an FA-18F Super Hornet. The photograph in question was captured by equipment on board the Super Hornet, which is one of the reasons why it hasn't been released to the public, with insiders noting that the photograph is still locked up with US officials, who don't talk about it and who have said that they likely won't be releasing it any time in the near future. Those who have seen the photograph have said that it was captured by the pilot of the east coast of the United States, and describe it as looking like a giant black triangle, with blunted edges and having spherical white lights on each of the corners. Tom Rogan, a national security writer, 
has come forward and said that the photograph does exist and says that he's been told about it from insiders. He said the following, It's the tip of the iceberg, but we will see more leaks of mysterious flying aircraft imagery and data in the coming years. US officials should get ahead of the curve and officially release more material. End quote. It's for this reason that some have said that these mysterious black triangles don't belong to us. Noting that if they aren't willing to share a photograph or talk about it, then it's likely that these things are coming from an outside source. Some online users have said that it's strange because in the last few years, we've basically been told that many of these crafts are actually seen out in the oceans, and this has caused some to put forward their own theories for why this is. For years now, people have said that they've seen strange objects flying in and out of the oceans, with many dismissing these claims as nothing more than made-up stories, but with insiders now admitting that many of these crafts have been seen in our oceans by US officials and the military, it's only caused more questions to be put forward, including who do they belong to, why are they more commonly seen out in the oceans, what's out there that's leading them to fly miles out to sea, why aren't these photographs being released? And ultimately, where are they coming from? So what do you make of these interesting photographs captured above the Large Hadron Collider? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.